According to the Minister of State for Youth and Children Affairs, Sarah Mateke, the Youth Livelihood Program YLP project that was started in 2013 has seen many achievements. Mateke recounted some of the youth successes achieved in their specific sectors under the YLP project across the country. Go to Luero, our youth are doing well in pineapples. If you go to Nakasongola, the youth are doing very well in a diary. There are those who are in rearing goats. There are those who are fattening uh, the bulls. And they are doing very well and they have even paid back our money. The minister said that one of the challenges being faced is the lack of willingness of some youth to repay the money back for other people to benefit. She also added that they will be supplementing existing programs with new interventions. The UN Joint Program for Adolescents and Youth, the New Action Plan for the Youth, Peace and Security, a reviewed national action plan for youth policy and integration of youth issues into government approaches are just some of the steps we are taking. These investments will enable our youth to harness opportunities, escape the poverty trap, and of course contribute meaningfully to our nation's progress. The minister noted that the belated International Youth Day celebrations that were postponed from 12th August will be commemorated on Friday 18th, 2023 at Chigizilua Primary School in Kavale under the theme Accelerating Recovery from COVID-19 and Full Implementation of Agenda 2030. The President, His Excellency Yuri Kakuta Museveni, is expected to be the chief guest. The government of Uganda has been unwavering in its commitment to supporting our youth during these trying times. Initiatives such as the Economic Stimulus Package, the Youth Livelihood Program, Uganda Women Entrepreneurship Program, and the establishment of innovation hubs, the training skills, uh, the training skills centers, exemplary our dedication to nurturing the potential of our youth. Maybe, uh, saving and they do share out at the end of the year.